while the city of LaPorte was hustling and bustling this weekend, hundreds of people braved the rain to visit Forest Edge Winery and enjoy some wine, art, and music at the 13th Annual Art Fair. For this week's Community Spotlight, Catherine Silver discovers why it's not just grapes that make fine wine. A cool and rainy day didn't stop hundreds of people from indulging in wine and art at this year's Forest Edge Winery Art Fair. But that's no surprise to Paul Schuster. Oh, it's a, become a, an important part of uh, the end of the summer in northern Minnesota for many people. And they'll drive from Fargo or Bismarck or Minneapolis just to come here. Each summer, the fair allows artisans and patrons to connect over conversation and crafts. I like the jewelry and some of the watercolors. I like it all. We have to come back every year and do the same thing. I love going through all the uh, crafts and art fair. And The event allows people to indulge in a variety of different activities like wine tasting, art viewing, and lots of food. We just got done doing the wine tasting and it's all very good. I come every year that I possibly can. I just love the, the atmosphere and the, the art and the wine and the music. <laughs> And even though that atmosphere may seem more Napa Valley than Northwoods. Who would ever expect something like this in the middle of the Northwoods? Schuster says it's that unique experience that keeps people coming back for more. Good food and wine always go together and good people in conversation. So we'll come back next year and the year after, I'm sure. Ensuring that good art, good wine and good people always make the perfect pairing. For this week's Community Spotlight, Catherine Silver, Lakeland News. This year's art fair featured over 30 artists. Next year's fair will be held the third weekend of August. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.